Omaha, Nebraska. Oh, what's Mark Henry doing out here? <laughs> hey, hey, Griff. What are you looking so smug about? I guess you haven't heard. Word has it, Mr. McMahon wants you in his office right away. Oh, but I'm sure it's only to tell you what a great job you've been doing. Great. Thanks for the tip, you chucklehead. A packed house in Omaha, Nebraska is in attendance for Monday Night Raw, just six days before WWE Elimination Chamber. There are definitely some big things afoot for the show, wouldn't you say, partner? I saw Mr. McMahon backstage before the show, and we all know he means business. I wonder if this may have anything to do with the WWE Championship picture. I hope so. I'm always nervous whenever Mr. McMahon is around. Somebody usually finds himself out of a job. No more of this, Santino. No more of this cowardly, just barely not losing. I'm not in WWE to not lose. I compete to win. I dumped you for a reason, remember? Please don't do this, Hartsway. Santino is sorry. Come back. We could be the biggest tag teamers of all the time. Get it through your head, Santino. Whether it says so on your scorecard or not, you're a loser. Whoa. We will be back, and I will continue my not losing ways. So I've got to find Maurice to do the... to set up the next challenge match. Is Maurice. Whoa, there goes Cody. I think that was Cody. shows up after I go to Vince's office. Because I don't think I can pass through here until after that. I could be wrong, though. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, nope, she's not here anyways. Yeah, maybe she doesn't show up till after I go to Vince's office. Oh, there she is. Excuse me? Ornswago? You squirted me with a squirt gun. I'm going to get him. Have you seen him? Look, Maurice, I'm much too important to concern myself with little trolls. But you have fun. Got a guide for where Hornswoggle is. Apparently he's right back here. There's a creature hiding behind the trainer's table. That's not quite preventative medicine. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm going to leave before this gets any stranger. <laughs> Did you find him? Did you find that evil leprechaun? I found Hornswoggle. He's in the trainer's room performing brain surgery on himself. Well, he's in the right spot. Because when I'm done with him, he's going to need a doctor. And then, 
Maybe I can finally start concentrating on my match tonight. You go do that thing you're gonna do then. And you're welcome. <laughs> I was stuck. I gotta change costumes as well before I move on. Mr. McMahon, I... Just cut to the chase, Chris. Why did you do it? Do, do what, Mr. McMahon? Don't play dumb with me. You stole the WWE Championship. Behind the champion's back. During a live televised match. Quite honestly, Mr. McMahon, I took the WWE Championship because, well, I think I deserve it. Triple H wouldn't give me a title shot. He's scared of me. What kind of champion is that? The kind we recognize as WWE Champion. Unlike you, who acted like a common thief. Now, if you don't mind, give me the championship right now. Otherwise, you're going to be fine. Listen, sir. I know you're a savvy businessman. I'm a valuable talent. But I see your position here. I will gladly return the championship to you. I just ask for the match I deserve at Elimination Chamber. How big would that be? Pay-per-view numbers would go through the roof. Okay, Jericho. I'll go along with this. For now. Thank you, sir. You're very welcome. Ew. He spit on it. And you're welcome to a match tonight. Something to get you in the championship mood. Something, as you say, to make ratings go through the roof. You're excused. Ew, stop spitting on the belt, you freak. Sorry. Let me go change outfits real quick back to the normal attire. We don't want that 20 minute load again. Still like a, a useless thing there. Holy shit. I got to take on Kofi, Mark Henry, and Batista in a handicap match. We're winning this one by fucking count out, that's for sure. Oh, I forgot about the challenge match first. <laughs> so yeah, this is the challenge match for this oh, week. Four. Gotta play as Maurice against Beth of Phoenix. Oh, she does it again. And there's the blind forearm. The stroke. I hit her with the stroke. What a nasty elbow. Fucking elbow the shit out of her. Beth's in trouble. Big suplex. I'm kicking the Another shit out of her. Kick. That's for sure. Look at this. Oh, that can't feel good. The kick connects. I didn't want to pin. A quick cover. Oh no, she countered. That Phoenix could she countered my signature. Race. Doesn't matter though. Oh, she countered it again. And Maurice counters it. Whoa. Fuck. 
keep pinning by mistake. I didn't want to pin. Yeah. Yeah. Get her up. It's over. What? There it is. Bow. No commentary. They're just silent. One, two, three. Silence for some reason. Here's your winner, Maurice. I did it. All right, now we roll on through to my handicap match that I have now. Oh, I gotta go back into the thing. Whoops. Oh, it's a gauntlet match. Okay, I thought it was a handicap match, but it's a gauntlet match. It's even better. I mean, it's just a series of one-on-one -on -one matches. As we start the match, Mr. McMahon, yeah. specifically for Chris Jericho, we are joined by Triple H. I've got my championship back, but if Jericho thinks all is forgiven, he's going to bitch. Bitch. That'll do some damage. Yeah. 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 Some damage. Listen to that chop echo throughout the arena. Jericho's looking to fly. How do you feel about having to defend your title against Jericho at Elimination Chamber? I can't wait to get my hands on him. He has no idea. Uh oh, here we go. Yeah, shut oh, up, Triple H. Fuck Jericho. all that. What you say? Ask him, Raf. Ask him. Tap. Tap Kofi. Ask him. And there goes the superstar. Let's go. Oh no. Oh no. You're gonna uh -oh. fuck it. You're gonna. Henry has the headlock. You're gonna take this fucking this code breaker. Code breaker. Jericho hits the code breaker. It's he over. No one code breaker is all I had to do. No oh, he kicked out at one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. How do you feel about having to defend your title against Jericho at Elimination Chamber? I can't wait to get my hands on him. He has no idea what awaits him in six days. Bitch. Bitch. You hear how his leg connected? Jericho from behind. Ooh, atomic big atomic drop. drop. Thought it was a suplex, but it was an atomic drop. He's putting those educated feet to good use. Yeah, oh. He drops Ow. the elbow. <laughs> yeah, I got him. Get more punishing than that. Yeah. Get it in. Get it in. Oh, he's in the ropes. I'm not letting go. In the ropes, but he refuses to release. Three, four. All right, I let go. I let go. I let go. Oh, no. Not code breaker. Jericho hits another code breaker. That's it. It's over. One, two, three. Come on in, Batista. Batista. Yeah. Maybe this whole thing was a ploy by Jericho? Of course it was. Bitch. Bitch. Beat me. History is proven. Bitch. Come Sunday, Bitch. Jericho will be just that. History.
Jericho into the headlock. Yeah, rake the eyes. That's such an effective move. Ouch, that's gotta hurt. Putting the beat down on him. I'm putting the beat down on him. You hear how his leg connected? Shut up, ref. Jericho going for the walls again. The yeah. Walls of Jericho yeah. Up. Roll him over. Yeah. Ask him. Jericho. I ask him. Tap Batista. Tap Dave. Tap Dave. Tap Dave. Would you look at this? Fighting and clawing with. He's going for it again. Wham, what a it's over. Breaker. After all of these shots to the head, I've got a feeling that soup. And this has got to be it. One, one, two, two, three, three. Say what you will about Jericho as a person, but you can't take anything away from him tonight. Three huge wins in one night, Michael. That's giving him some huge momentum heading into Elimination Chamber. Jericho I beat The Rock and Stone Cold in the tonight. same night, and but I beat Kofi Kingston, Mark Henry, and Batista in the same the night. Elimination Chamber. I notice he's not even making eye contact with you, Triple H. Will Elimination Chamber be Chris Jericho's last stand?